Um, now, today, the remote control torture is an unbelievable headache. What are they doing? Uh, by remote control, they're, you know, taking the skull muscles, and I don't know what they're doing, but it's an unbelievably very painful headache by remote control from the people who torture me. Yes, headaches are caused by other people who have electronic machines that are targeting you. Because every time you get a headache, you don't care what you've been told, it's a lie. There are human beings that target you and give you every fucking sickness that you ever had. Because you're God. And the only thing that can go and hurt God is God. And these are people who are using their godlike powers to torture you. Uh, it's just part of giving people enough rope to hang themselves, I suppose. No one would believe that somebody who was part of God would go around torturing other part of God, but they do all the time. Those things that say they're part of God and are using God's powers are not godly, are they? No, they're devils. And they're gloating. Just so you know, the people who torture you by remote control and make you sick, whatever it is, throughout your whole lifetime... There are people who gloat when by remote control they make you sick and they watch you by remote control all the time. I don't even, I've got nothing else to tell you. There are human beings who are beyond evil. Beyond evil. And very soon you are going to see who they are. And very soon you're going to get yourself an enormous fist. And you are going to smack a motherfucker. You are going to smack a motherfucker who's never been smacked in its entire existence. An entire multiple lifetime arc of story of them. Lifetime after lifetime torturing people like you by remote control. The technology has existed for multiple generations. We are in a prison camp. Those of us like me. You were in a prison camp and were attacked all the time by evil people. And these evil people, you know who they are. Which ones? Well, they are going to come up and you're going to know them. This one is an evil one. This one ain't. Are they in your community? The answer is you're going to find out that your community is loaded with evil people that you thought were good people. You're going to be shocked and surprised to know that secretly behind the smile of a loving face is an evil motherfucker. Because the evil, you don't have to do anything. You don't have to hit them. Because they're going to, I don't know, appear like somebody hit them in the head. They're going to walk around with a lot of black eyes and bruises. Because these motherfuckers are um, going to have something called the Nutter Syndrome. People who are evil are going to start punishing themselves for being evil. Evil people are start going to do straight crazy things. Uh, they're going to do crazy things because they're insane. And the crazy things are going to show you they're insane. And then what? I don't know. The evil ones are going to drop dead. And then maybe it's going to be a very long time before anybody gets the full and complete idea of what happens to people who are evil when they die. And the answer is, the Roman Catholic tells you they go to the local, local constabulary. I don't know. I don't know where this one goes. And they do what? I don't think that one's going to go very far. No, the Roman Catholic tells you if you're evil, you go to the lake of fire. So there's going to be a lot of things that go to the lake of fire. Because I'm hijacked by evil, the people that give me a horrendous headache are the ones that are in every video hijack me. And they think it's funny to make videos. They force me to do this all the time. Because they use their will against you. Magnify their will to make you a duppy. What's a duppy? It's a zombie and voodoo. I can't stop this. I cannot stop this. This thing is impossible for me to stop the attack on this body. 
So, you know, a victim victimizer people that are saying, well, you know, you did something, I can't help you out. This is new karma. Everything, every attack on all of us is new, horrible karma. You're going to wonder, how could it go generations over? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We're going to find out a lot of stuff about the people who are running these karmic systems. We're going to find out a lot of things about people that you thought were godlike, who are devils, and devils who you thought were. You know, no, no. You're going to find out that more and more, there's very few in the way of benevolent beings. Very few. But we have all the power. And the evildoers, they're like, you know, showing you what that's going to happen to them. It's the karate chop. The karate chop, because I promised this evildoer that tortures me that that person is going to be chopped up, I don't know, with a butcher blade, and it's going to be turned into snake soup, because there's going to be an awful lot of snaky people that are going to be chopped. You won't have to do it. The spirit is going to supernaturally show you things that you're going to go... Oh, wow. Not only do I have an unbelievable, horrendous enemy who's been torturing us for generations, but we have a friend in God, and God is going to display its wrath. The wrath of God is going to come out. And just as they're torturing me, the wrath of God is going to show the evildoer that, you know, it doesn't need any human hands in order to punish the evildoer. The evildoers are going to have their eyes popped out, literally, literally exploding out of their heads. They're going to be motherfucking devils that are going to learn what it's like to get smacked by mama. Because Mama God is beyond furious at these people. Beyond furious, the wrath of God. The wrath of God is coming from David fucking Burroughs. Because David fucking Burroughs, my father, is a devil. And anyway, the wrath of God that he puts out is coming around money multiplied. That means multiplied and multiplied and multiplied. And Mama is coming around to tell David the fuck Beelzebub fucking Burroughs at 2621 Park Row Street in Thunder Bay that you must motherfucker about to get swapped because you're evil David and all this shit that's happening and hitting me is your fucking evil David and all kinds of other evil fucking shit people that think that their shit don't stink David you're about to roast motherfucker and your motherfucking wife is gonna roast too I can't help you out 78% of humanity off the top is gonna roast because they're under 200 on the scale and then most of the rest of the people are under 540 which is the galactic law and if you're not out there then you're an ally of evil. And so you will be going to the lake of fire because you didn't raise your consciousness. And in the middle of all kinds of horrible, horrible, there's people like Bob who are directly being tortured. Civilians tortured while the militaries look the other way and the police forces won't take a police report. So there's a whole pile of people who think they're in the protection racket and they are. And they belong to, maybe they think they belong to the government of Justin fucking Trudeau, but really they work for Tony fucking Supreme. And those motherfuckers' heads are all going to go pop, 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 like popcorn. Because we saw that in the Kingsman. In the Kingsman movie, we saw evil fucking people's heads blown off. And that's what's going to be. All kinds of people who are secretly part of all kinds of secret goody societies for goodies for them are going to have their heads blown off. I don't know. It's just, you know, what happens when the wrath of God. It's just the evil poop you put out. You just spin around and multiply, multiply, and come back and whack them. And rub them out, and that's what's going on, is the great rubbing out of evil. So I don't know, we're probably going to notice. I don't know. You just keep watching. I don't know, I just don't know. Anyways, the evil doers are still playing fuckface games today. Sure, you know, whenever the wrath of God comes, you can add one more day to this enormous tornado, this hurricane of... Yeah, paying you all back, fuckers. I can help you out. When the world has changed, when all these evil people are, you know, rubbed out, I don't think we're ever going to be happier and celebrate more. Because I still have this remote control headache. And I've got herky-jerky going on with my body. And I haven't had a rest in six fucking years. So, I don't know, I just keep your eyes open because I'm sure you're going to learn very soon whether you're one of the motherfucking devils who hits 
themselves over the head 1,200 million times by being hurtful to others. I can't help you out. This is the way it goes for me. I don't even know what the word's there because it's all hijacked. This is what it's like to be a hijacked person. Hijacked by remote control, by evil fucking people. I can't help you out. Your evil fucking people are on their last laugh because they're gloating and laughing because they found something that still works. Anyways, because they know they've lost the war, they have. The evildoer has lost the war before they started. Any moron would know that. But in the end, they're beyond stupid, and, and we've had to suffer with them because this is the way that they get rid of them. Is they just have got to give them lots of rope. The unbelievable, horrific black, black, black karma. The blackest of the black lagoon, karma. Karma, 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 karma. And then when the karma comes along and the karma hits somebody in the head, it rubs them out. And it ain't going to be rubbing me out because I'm a survivor. I've survived this fucking torture for six fucking years, all day, every day. Well, that's the way it is. Some of us have got to suffer enormously in order to allow evildoers to do evil so they can get the horrible karma. And the horrible karma that rubs them out and gets rid of all this all, all yelled together. It's going to be quite something. We were promised quite a domino show. That's what we were promised. Domino. Domino fall. And you know, it's like, you know, I don't know. I don't know. 20, 25,000 dominoes. Have you seen those videos on YouTube? Yeah, that's the way it is. It's going to be quite something. And they showed you also in the Kingsman movie. It was all choreographed. The death of the evildoer. So, you know, it's going to be quite something for those of us who are going to survive. Because we made 540. We passed the course. Earth school. And all the people who flunked are going to be severely punished. Because that's the way it is. You want to be a fuckface and not do your homework? And you don't want to study for the exam and you don't want to do, you know, follow along with what you were taught in kindergarten, motherfucker? If you can't do as good as what they taught you, I'm sorry. And it's very difficult to tell you, but if you can't do kindergarten, if you can't be kind to your neighbors on planet Earth, then this is the end of you as being human, and the beginning of you as being officially a devil in the lake of fire. Forever. Fuck face, I can't help you out. I hope you enjoyed your day torturing Bobby Burroughs, because forever and forever and forever, motherfucker, you're going to be paying it back.